What's going on YouTube and welcome to another episode of Any Button Gaming. As always, I'm your host Jesse Georgie and it's another Tech Thursday. So this time around it is sports week and we didn't want to talk about traditional tech like FIFA or 2K, nothing like that. We're talking about something a little bit more interesting. We're talking driving simulators. From wheels to gears to pedals, driving simulators have been around for a while, but over the last couple of years, they've gotten a lot better. So let's get right into it. Now, what would a driving simulator be without the wheels and the pedals? It wouldn't really be a rig at all. So that's where we're gonna start. Logitech has created one of the most well-known driving rigs in gaming right now. The driving force is the go-to setup for any gamer. The pedals are pressure sensitive, giving you better control and making you feel like you're really in that car. The G29 and G920 will set you back about $300, but it's a must buy for any racing fan. Luckily, I got the opportunity to try out a full racing setup, so here's some footage from that experience. Now, while most fans are content using the paddle shifters on the back of the wheel, if you're someone that wants a bit more of an authentic experience, you can purchase the Logitech shifter. This six speed H pattern shifter is perfect for any fan that wants to add a little more realism to the experience. If you want, you can purchase the Logitech shifter right now for $60 US. Now that setup is perfect for whatever you need, but as we all know, there's always a couple of gamers that need to go above and beyond. That's when we call in the Playsee Revolution. The Playsee Revolution is coated with high quality vinyl. It's got a unique foldable design, quick assembly, and is compatible with all racing setups on the market. It was even developed alongside pro racers, so you know it's gotta be legit. Now while this setup is obviously amazing, amazing ain't cheap. It's gonna set you back about $500 USD, so you know, if you got the money, go for it. If not, you don't even need it. Now, that's all we have for this episode of Tech Thursday. Don't forget to tune in tomorrow where I sit down for another interview. If you liked the video, don't forget to hit that like button and smash that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.